This is SM Jaidusen, project leader and scientific officer, molecular modeling and drug design laboratory. I am Radu Dash, research assistant, MMDDM. And this is Mohammad Janayat, graduate research student and research assistant, MMDDM. In this video, we would like to give you an outline of our article on the topic of in silico based vaccine design against Ebola virus glycoprotein. -like Ebola is an antisense strand RNA virus from the filoviridae family, caused more than 24 epidemics reported from Africa. Despite having available molecular knowledge of this virus, no definite vaccine or other remedial agents have been developed yet for the management and avoidance of Ebola virus infections in humans. Therefore, we focused on in silico epitope based peptide vaccine considering glycoproteins of Ebola. We identified both T cell and B cell epitope by using different types of computational approaches like immunoinformatics, bioinformatics, and molecular simulation studies. Before digging into deep, we first collected all the available glycoprotein sequence and analyzed their degree of similarity. And then we screened out most antigenic protein by Vaxigen web server. Here, T cell epitopes has been identified by various immunoinformatics web based software of IEDB, where we identified five Nymar epitopes. Among them, these epitopes showed better population conservancy and population coverage. For further clarification, we docked all epitopes into HLA3250 and calculated its binding energy by MMGBSA and MMPBSA. Both these calculations support our previous results. To concern flexibility, we performed 100 nanosecond molecular simulation where we found that both HLA and epitope have remarkable conformation changes to facilitate the binding and formed stable complex in thermodynamic environment. The B cell epitope stimulates minimum immunity that is strong enough to elicit a potent humoral immunoresponse. Considering of aminoacid property, hydrophilicity, accessibility, flexibility, turns, exposed surface, polarity, and antigenic propensity of the protein, we determined the sequences ranging from 186 to 220 as a B cell epitope. We hope that the design epitope-based vaccine would manifest long-lasting immunity against Ebola virus.